Hey guys, it's give it to Gamer, and I am back here again, making you guys another video, and I hope you guys enjoy it. So guys, today, we're going to be reacting to Pokemon Sword and Shield, new rivals, and new team trader. So if you guys don't know what this trader is, uh, well, I have to go ahead and say new team and new rivals, because that's what this, uh, well, well, actually, that's what it says right here, so yeah. It's, the, the wording on the, on the, uh, of the trader right here is a little bit long, so I had to go ahead and cut it short because it, it sounded a little bit different. It didn't sound like the way how it's how I said it. But right here we get to go ahead and see a new rivals, which is awesome. We got to see some new rivals, new characters that are gonna be battling out with Pokemon, and we're gonna be having a new team. So this is gonna be really interesting, guys, because every time when it comes to a new Pokemon game, we always have ourselves a new, different, evil. A team that goes in and tries to steal Pokemon or try to go ahead and do something to take over the world and all that stuff. So yeah, um, but anyways, guys, this gets me excited. Like I said, um, uh, in my previous trade reactions to Pokemon Sword and Shield, I'm a big fan of Pokemon. I've been watching the movies, I've played the games, and I'm been watching the TV series. So yeah, I've been following Pokemon for a long time, and this game is gonna be coming out. Um, couple months comes out in uh, what was it November comes out in November um, a couple a couple weeks before yeah wait before yeah be, be, a couple weeks before my birthday so that's this right here is gonna be a great uh, birthday present for me so I'm actually excited to go ahead and get this and it's gonna, it's gonna be actually my first time playing a Pokemon game on switch because when it came to the new Pokemon games, they always came out on the DS's, but now it's time to things to be upgraded now, and things are going to be moving on to the Switch. So, you know what? If things are starting to upgrade and change, I guess I have to go ahead and follow through. So yeah, it's going to be really interesting because I do not actually own and have a Switch. So this one is going to be actually my first time. And maybe I might do a video of me unboxing the Switch. So yeah, let's just wait and see. And also me unboxing the Pokemon game. <laughs> I'm excited. But anyways guys, let's not waste some more time. Let's go ahead and watch the uh, new rivals and new team in Pokemon Sword and Shield. Let's do it. Ugh. Galarian forms. Galarian forms? <laughs> Weezy! So different forms of Pokemon, the Galarian Weezy. Hey, a Zigzagoon. Galarian Zigzagoon. Oh, that's a different version of a uh, Lunoon. Oh shit! Abstagon. Oh sh no, Abstagoon. Oh, this is really interesting because Zigzagoon only had two evolutions. A form changing Pokemon. Okay, so this is a brand new Pokemon. More Peko, Footy Betty mode. Oh, damn, he's. Damn, he's like freaking mad. <laughs> now you really made him mad. Not good. Okay, so I think that was just, uh, I'm trying to think, a different form of him, maybe, I don't know. So this is a new rival that we're going to be facing. We have another one here, too. Oh, freaking Walkers, Team Yell. So let's say D, this team is going to be an annoying, obnoxious, punk rock uh, team. Interesting, really, really interesting. You know, the one thing that I actually like when it comes to new teams that are in Pokemon, I actually like what is the word? I'm trying to think of the word. Um, every time when a new team comes out, I always like the music that they put in for the new teams. I mean, which one was one of my favorites that I liked? Trying to think, there's like there's like a bunch of them. 
We had Team Plasma for Pokemon uh, Black and White. That right there, their theme were uh, their, their their theme was catchy. And then we also had um, uh, Pokemon. Uh, what was it? Pokemon Sun and Moon with uh, Team Skull. That right, that that theme was cool. Uh, I'm trying to think. There's been a bunch of teams, dude. That is so. You guys have to excuse me. I mean, that guys, we're on the freaking eighth generation of Pokemon. I mean, can you believe it? Eighth generations of Pokemon. Unbelievable, guys. But yeah, so, anyways, uh, before I go ahead and get a little bit sidetracked. Okay, so this right here is a little bit interesting because the Pokemon Zigzagoon only actually had two forms. It only had the Zigzagoon first form, and then it had it's uh, Linoon form when it evolves and it only had two evolutions but now since we're on a different generation and we are on a different uh, region in Pokemon Zigzagoon has a third evolution and you guys saw my face I was like what? that's freaking crazy oh yeah also not to mention Zigzagoon this time his color is black and white so he's not the zigzagoon that's like the brown and light brownish. This time it's uh, black and white. So that way they change things up a little bit. So yeah guys. And also yeah like I said with the new team. You know this time the team looks a little bit different. It's called Team Yell. And like I said they're like freaking annoying, obnoxious, punk rock. Um, I guess I could say teens I guess. Uh, or you know. I don't know why. Uh, I always freaking forget what age the teams are on. Uh, they had to be like in their, like, you know, late teens, I guess, maybe. I don't know. But yeah, like I said, really, really cool. We're going a little bit different now because on the last Pokemon game, which is Pokemon Sun and Moon, we actually had Team Skull, which were, they were kind of like the rapish, thuggish type uh, teams and all that stuff. You know, doing the yo, yo, man, all that stuff. That was so weird making doing that. I can't do it because I'm too gamer. But anybody else can do it. Like Two Fly can do that, and MV Cool can do that. Not me. I'm not the kind of person that's all hip and all that stuff. Yeah. Anyways, so yeah, I guess it's kind of cool that they're changing that now. No more, you know, gangster thuggish type now. Now we're moving on to the uh, punkish, obnoxious team. So yeah. I was about to say something else bad. Just had to change the word a little bit. <laughs> but guys, like I said, I'm excited guys. Like I said, Pokemon Sword and Shield comes out on the 15th of November. And that right there is actually one week before my birthday. So, like I said, great birthday present. And the one cool thing is, this game is going to be coming out one week. Not only before my birthday, but on Black Friday. So, if I'm able to go ahead and get this game in a nice, decent deal, we're good. We are all nice and good. So, yeah. And I get to go ahead and save some money. Um, not only for the game, but for the Switch too. Because I know that the Switch is really expensive. It's like $300. That's, just, whew, that's crazy. So, hopefully, I'll, I'll be able to go ahead and get a good deal when it comes to uh, Black Friday. But, anyways, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you guys are excited for Pokemon Sword and Shield. I'm excited. And I just can't wait to play the game. But anyways guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Stay tuned guys. Bye.